What's going on gang and welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to take a look at how you can steal sauce from all the industry pros and how you could even go about finding mentorships from people that have things that you want. So let's get right into this. All right guys, so first let's talk about how you can steal sauce and different ideas and techniques from industry producers. So there's a couple different ways. The first one is gonna be streaming. So Twitch is a really great platform that a lot of big industry producers are on and they'll go on there from time to time and cook up beats. So you usually watch YouTube videos, but YouTube videos are edited, so you don't see exactly everything that goes into it. So you might be missing a step and you can't get your sound to sound the same as them. Well, when you're on a live stream, they can't really edit it as they're live. So you're gonna see exactly what they're doing from point A to point B to get their track to a finished state. There's a couple producers that I recommend and I'm gonna recommend the Ableton producers first because I know a lot of us are using Ableton. So you should go ahead and follow Kenny Beats and Decap on Twitch. Both of them go on there from time to time and cook up beats, sometimes from scratch, sometimes they finish an idea. But if you go on there, you can definitely steal things that they're doing and bring them into your own production to level up your craft immediately. So there's a couple other people I'd like to recommend as well. One of them being Superstaro. So if you've been in any of my live streams, we usually raid Superstaro at the end because he's always got beat battles going on where he gives away lots of cash prizes. He also reviews beats and he cooks up beats on live. So you can see exactly what he's doing and he has a lot of the biggest songs out there right now as well. Another really great producer to follow on there is Based One. And you may be thinking, who's Based One? Well, as soon as I say the tag, you're gonna know exactly who it is. So his tag goes like this. Base One got them bands, ho. Yeah, he's on a lot of the biggest records that are out there right now from Lil Skies to Kid Leroy, Juice World to like everywhere out there right now. RIP Juice World, I know he's not around anymore, but that's another really great producer to definitely look into because he's always cooking up beats on his live streams. Also, Nick Mira. You should follow Nick Mira on there because he's always cooking up beats as well. He doesn't get on the streams as often, but when he does, he cooks up like three beats at a time sometimes, and you can learn a lot just from watching his streams as well. Another really big producer that streams every once in a while is Cash Money AP. So I would de definitely recommend you go ahead and give him a follow so that you know when he is live, because when he does go live, he's always cooking up tons of beats and he's talking to the chat the whole time and you can ask him questions and he actually responds to the chat a lot as well. So go ahead and give these guys a follow and check out their streams when they're going live because you can learn so much just by watching them cook up beats. All right, so now let's talk about mentoring sessions. Going ahead and finding mentors that can get on a one-on-one -on -one call with you that you can ask direct questions to. Now, there's a big thing that you need to take in consideration before you do this. You gotta make sure the person that you're mentoring with has something that you want. So maybe they have a super solid mix, maybe they have some crazy trap drums, maybe they make beat battle beats that are really insane. You gotta figure out what exactly you're looking for at that time and find somebody that can do that, that you've heard their beats, that you know they can help you get to where you wanna be. So I always like to say, don't go to a homeless person for life advice, right? Obviously you wouldn't do that, and the same thing applies for music producers and mentoring. You gotta find someone who's got something you want so that you can go ahead and steal the gems from in that one-on-one -on -one session. But there's also another thing that you're gonna to wanna to take into consideration. And that is, you're not gonna be able to get these mentoring sessions with the top producers, right? You're not gonna be able to hit up Murder Beats, you're not gonna be able to hit up Cash Money AP, Kenny Beats, you know, all of these big producers, they're not willing to do that. There is no price you can pay for that. You just have to know them in person and be able to get in the studio with them. So, what you gotta do is you gotta find someone who hasn't blown up yet, whose social media isn't through the roof, who doesn't have a big head on their shoulders and who actually has time to go ahead and sit down with you and offer that. Because honestly, if you were able to get like a session with some of these other guys, they're gonna charge you thousands and thousands of dollars for that. And let's be honest, we don't really have that kind of money. 
So I also offer mentoring sessions. So if you want to check that out, there's links in the description below and you can go ahead and check that out if I have something that you want and that you really can't grip onto. I do mentoring sessions every single week with different producers and shout out to all of you guys, you know who you are, that have came and gotten mentoring sessions from me and I've had nothing but love. Everybody's loved it. They've learned so much and it's honestly a blast for us both to do. So if you're interested in that, what I do is I record the video so that you don't have to take notes the whole time and I'm going to send that video to you right after as well. You're also going to get the Ableton template file that we work on during the video. You're going to get my drum kit if you don't already have it and you're going to get access to me to be able to message me whenever you want if you have any extra questions. Otherwise, you're going to have to go out there and start looking at some new streamers, probably people you haven't heard of, maybe get into some communities and like find people that are submitting beats for beat battles or things like that. And then you're going to have to contact them one on one to go ahead and see if they even offer something like that. But when you do these mentoring sessions, you can figure out your problem like right away. You know what I mean? Because if you're having a problem with your mix, your drums just aren't hitting. It's usually just a couple things that you have to tweak. And it takes someone that's been where you're at to just show you really quick where it is. So you can literally go from like level zero to like level 10 in a matter of an hour. It's it can be life changing. I've actually mentored with a lot of other producers. I mentored with a mastering engineer who isn't like super crazy popular yet. And that's how I was able to get through to him and be able to do that. But that mastering engineer that I mentored with that I was talking about, I wanted to work on my mixing and mastering a lot. So that's why I went with him and he was able to show me pretty much every single thing that I needed to know. And honestly, I studied the video that he gave me afterwards and I leveled up insane after that. So it can be very, very beneficial for you to throw out $50, $100, however much it may be to get the advice that you really need to keep moving forward. One other thing I want to mention is on these streams, a lot of times these streamers have like beat battles or they will critique your live or they will critique your music live. So even when you're doing these beat battles, there's going to be feedback in the chat. Sometimes he's going to give you feedback when you submit it. He's going to be like, you know, I like that, but it just really wasn't hitting hard enough. And you can get some like things to work on just by doing it that way. And if you happen to catch a critique and be able to get your beat critiqued, then you're going to notice, then you're going to get called out on those things that you're doing wrong. And you're going to know right away what you need to work on. With that being said, every single Saturday at 9 p.m. Central Standard Time, I go live on Twitch to review your guys' beats. So that's a really easy and free way for you to submit your music and get some feedback on exactly the things that I think you should be working on. And right now, we don't even have very many people that join the streams. We maybe get like 7 to 10 people right now. So if you actually catch one of my streams on a Saturday, it's guaranteed that you're going to get your beats played. And I've actually been playing multiple of people's beats just because we have a lot of time and we hang out and have so much fun. So you could even potentially get a couple of your beats reviewed if you get in my streams now before people start rushing in. So definitely consider doing that. All right, guys, so that wraps up the video. I hope you guys liked that one and smash the like button if you did. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're new here because we're uploading daily videos that you're not going to want to miss out on. And besides that, I'll be catching you guys again in the next one. Peace out.